Okay, so these are the NASA people and they will be here tomorrow doing a live stream and they have a couple of uh, cameras here especially set up to view the sun. You see it right there. They have a uh, tracking heads on their tripods and they did a test run with them today. You can see over there are their two laptops and they have a HDMI connection from the cameras over to the laptops and they play there and uh, their test worked out well today. So tomorrow is the live stream. get an idea of what might be happening with the winds and the weather around us before tomorrow's event. Pop, good girl. So here are my two very important um, Poppy, is everything a toy girl? Is everything a toy? It's a silly cat. So we open the filter that way and pull it on through. Okay, so that's the 77. That's for the 7200 Canon EOS L series lens. And this is the 95 millimeter. See, it's considerably larger. And that is going to go on the Sigma 15600 Sportsman lens. So I'm looking forward to uh, photographing the solar eclipse tomorrow. All right. So we will see you tomorrow. Oh, lots are full. Okay, so those are the balloons here at the uh, Albuquerque morning lighting flights or whatever you call them. The mass ascension. The mass ascension. And uh, so it's daybreak. You can see the sun's creeping up behind. And, uh, and now we'll have to go someplace else to watch the balloons and the cliff. I caught a shooting star right there. Pretty cool. Yeah. The police just drove by saying all lots are full. So that's uh, just not going to happen here. Hmm. And Jimmy's not even there. Here you go. Uh, everybody in the world is Good morning signal. The what? We are still fighting traffic in all directions. It is a crazy mess out there. But we are watching the balloons, the ascension, mass ascension, and we do actually score a handicapped parking spot 100 feet from the opening of the uh, fairground. Unbelievable. Kelly's sister has a disabled pass. Take a picture here and see what we are getting. Okay, so time to adjust the camera again. So I will have the uh, lovely Miss Kelly, the woman reporter on the scene. Yes, I record prepayment. Oh, you got it. Is it recording? Yes. What am I recording? So over yonder is a black van that says free pumpkin lattes. That's not true, but Seattle ballooning or Seattle balloons, they're from Seattle. They got us to go over there, so I met the CEI. Oh my gosh, I can talk. C 
CEO guy and the head pilot are here. They've been on the road for about a month now. <laughs> and we are watching the opening of the eclipse as the moon moves further and further over the sun and we will see the eclipse circle. This is the uncorrected uh, look of the eclipse with an infrared ultraviolet filter on it. This is the annular eclipse with the color restored and some other editing done to it. And now we're going to see the closing sequence as the moon passes beyond the sun and the sun comes back. And this is what everybody came down to see the eclipse was for, to get a picture of the total eclipse, an annular eclipse where the sun is not quite totally covered by the moon. So this, uh, I used a NISI Missy filter on it, which is a 16 f-stop and infrared ultraviolet filtering. And that's why it is uh, showing essentially a white, light gray appearance. You have to take that through and color correct it, uh, add color back in, and then uh, do some sharpening and other Photoshop work to it to get it the way you want it. And the finished product you see here, the orange sun-colored ring is what you actually saw during the total eclipse if you were wearing eclipse viewing glasses. So this is it. This is what all the hubbub was about to get a picture of the total annular eclipse and I just happened to get a pretty good shot right center of it in Albuquerque. So we came to the right place, we had the right weather, and it was a lot of fun. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, leave any comments, ask any questions, and I will see you on the next video. This is the full annular eclipse sequence from beginning to end without interruption or anything else. Very cool. And we'll finish this video with the star of the show, the full annular eclipse, where you can see the perfect circular ring because we were in Albuquerque. 